Head on over to our affiliates at inkgaming.com to pick up play mats, deck boxes, sleeves, anything that you need to get your game night going. Maybe even get yourself a custom play mat. Check out the link in the description below. And stop. <laughs> I do fine. not have flying. I, you do? I don't. You, you said I, nobody does? Nobody has. But I only have like one of those in the deck, I think. One four, well, I hope so, because you're only allowed one. <laughs> <laughs> I either have one or one, I don't know. So draw, roll, six. six. I will sacrifice this to carry on feeder to have it go to a 4-4 four, four now. Uh, no, that one ended oh, okay. before oh, I attacked. This happened after, and it doesn't matter because I'm not going to use it. I would have accepted no. I'm at power. seven. That's not cool. I'm, sh I'm basically just trying to focus them down. Might as well just throw them out. And they're going <laughs> to. <laughs> He's right. So Six, it's not my turn. Yeah, what am I doing? 16, 2. 14, 10. Yay! I don't go last, even though I rolled up. I go last. <laughs> Put All these right. over here. Yeah, I'll right. put them in your deck box so that way you leave them. <laughs> Everybody draw a good hand, ready to. Well, well, well I've drawn and I'm going to keep it. All right. Good Hand's enough. good enough, yeah. All right. I am playing Zeria the Golden Sting. Flying haste. Whenever Zira the Golden Sting attacks, put an egg counter on another target creature without an egg counter on it. When that creature dies, if it has an egg counter on it, draw a card and create a 1-1 one, one black insect uh, creature oh. token with flying. So, I got a lot of insects and I got a lot of ways to kill everything in here. You know, uh, snakes, insects, um, I have Eldrazi in there, so that's all it's in hand right now. Ish. Nah! Uh, uh. <laughs> Go ahead, Vince. Okay, I'm going to be playing a Traxa Praetor's Voice. It has oh. been around for a while, but the new set has inspired me, so she has a 4 4 Flying oh. Vigilant Death Touch, death touch wow. Life Link. At the beginning of my end step, I proliferate, so obviously I want to proliferate a lot. Did you just build around creatures, or did you, like, any super friends in there? No, I didn't do the Super Friends. I know some people like that and want to do that, so I actually just kind of went with more of a Toxic, Infect, Proliferate. Not the 1-1 one, one counter Proliferate, be clear about that. Gotcha. Okay. okay. I'm going back to uh, Unsanctioned, was it? Unfinity. Unfinity, that's right. I'm playing the Space Family Goblinson. Uh, the Space Family Goblinson has Trample as long as you've rolled three or more dice this turn. Whenever you roll a die, put a 1-1 one, one counter on the Space Family Goblinson. Alright. And then I am playing Akira, uh, Akira the Fearless Voyager. Ooh. And this one gives me whenever it has, uh, whenever you attack a player with one or more equipped creatures, I draw a card, I can pay a white. To unattach an equipment from a creature I control, and then tap it, and it gets indestructible until end of turn. He wasn't reading a card, he just knew that. <laughs> <laughs> What's your, uh, lots of equipment. Which, how'd you build it? Oh, yeah, it's uh, a lot of equipment, well, and cards. a lot of creatures that have equipment. <laughs> okay. There's equipment Very that descriptive. makes creatures, too. You gotta do I just keep Ultron, swinging Ultron, high aggro. Ultron. Almost at Voltron. Voltron. All right. Well, I'm not playing the Voltron Commander. <laughs> That's in the deck. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna kick it off. Draw, and I will play a Luxury Suites. Uh, enters the battlefield tapped unless you uh, unless you control uh, have to control. But I'm your friend. <laughs> unless you have two or opponents. <laughs> He's your friend. He's not Look, opponent. <laughs> friends are opponents. You just haven't killed yet. <laughs> so I have one, two, three, two opponents. Untapped. Go. <laughs> All right, I will draw. I'm going to play Phyrexian Forest for land, and I will 
tap that for a Glistener Elf. She is a 1-1 one, one Infect Elf. My, oh my. Past the Infect is starting early. I will play a command tower and pass. All right, draw off the turn. Mountain, go ahead. Okay. Ooh, that simple, simple turn. Oh, I'm a dumb. Choices? Well, I'm going to play a mountain. Untapped, because I have. Okay. <laughs> Wow, and that's all I can really do. So Ooh. I'm just gonna pass. Yeah. Alright, yeah, I'll untap and draw. Um boy, I need to attack someone. You sure do. Ooh, to attack. Simon? Alright, yeah, oh, I wonder why. One, Simon. Wow. <laughs> I was won the last two games. Yeah, it doesn't. I, I get to the poison tap. I don't want to think and damn it. Yeah, sleep. you do. Oh you need a <laughs> I need the poison. So my turn? No. Oh, oh. I want to play a land for turn. Nice. It's a Terramorphic Expanse. Can I have that? And... Stop. <laughs> uh, I'll pass. And I'm going to tap and crack the Terramorphic Expanse. Who gets me as a lands? Mm. Oh, you're taking your turn. And I'm going to get a Swamp and put that in play tapped and shuffle. I will play a wooden bridge line. And the 2023 model? Right. <laughs> draw it sounds turn. like a car. Is it? It is a play car. Play a planes and wooden bridge line. Two for armory veteran. Four by four. It's a special like edition Hans. Armory veteran. With the old style wood panel. And this has, as long as it's equipped, it it's gains menace. Ah. Uh, Go ahead. Shade. Dang it. It's got something out. Ooh, not cool. Okay. Well, you just steered this creature away from you. Um, Indeed. Play a swamp, and then I will pay three, and I will play an Ophio, uh, Ophio Mancer. Oh, that's good. At the beginning of each upkeep, if you control no snakes, create a one-one snake creature token with that touch. It's a two-two. You got that from Jumpstart? Yeah. I didn't even know they reprinted it. I have the one from the Commander deck. <laughs> well, and it came with the uh, black Commander. Yeah, the Liliana mm -hmm. one. So I need to mark a thing so I can remember to do the thing. And I will pass the turn. P the T. Okay. Kids say. One tap my land, one tap my elf, and draw. I. What do I want to do? Something smart? No, probably not. I'll play an island for land, and I will tap the island and the swamp for a void wing hybrid. It is a 2 1 flying toxic one. When I proliferate, proliferate, I get to return this from my graveyard to my hand. Oh, that's real good. I will, you guys get to Dan, I'll take you for one infect. Because he's wide open. You got a, uh, you are wide open. You got yeah. a thing, mister. <laughs> and I don't have everything else, so I will pass to Dan. Untap, draw. <laughs> One, two. Goblin Morning Star. Artifact, equipment. Uh, equipped creature gets plus one plus zero and has trample. Uh, equipped for two. When Goblin Morning Star enters the battlefield, roll a d20. 14. 10 to 20, create a 1 1 red goblin creature token. And then attach Goblin Morning Star to it. Nice. Oh. Yay. Pretty good. Dagron's Beasts, Monarch, Dagron Spirits. Is that a goblin? I need a Gorblin, yeah. Gorblin, Gorblin. Oh, there you Gorblins. Go. Would you like a designer Gorblin? Sure. <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Yeah. Un infinity. Or, that's not infinity. All right, I now have a, a two one a goblin. Nice. Um, now, three, four, five, six, I will bounce a command tower back to my hand in exchange for a gruel turf. Gruel turf. 
<laughs> Alright, that's how I'm doing. Yeah, Alright. On tap. Draw for turn. Going to play a planes. And then I will tap three for Curie Fearless Voyager. So just casting my commander. Chase. You got yeah. two people you can attack. Well, no, it's not equipped, so it's just a 2-2 oh, right now. Oh, it'd be equipped, okay. Um, Two, wasn't, three. wasn't a paying attention yeah. to Yeah. You could literally attack anybody. That is all I'm going to do for the turn. Oh, all right. Interesting. All right, beginning of my upkeep, I create a 1-1 one, one black uh, snake with that touch. If you have no snakes. Which I did not. Right. You know, the only problem with the jumpstart set was they have these creatures that have these tokens, but there's no tokens in the set. Oh, right, because they only put 20 cards in the pack. And you can't put those tokens because those would be helpful for people to have. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to put out a Smoldering Marsh. Uh, enters the battlefield tapped unless you control two. Yeah, unless you control two more basic lands. Two. Well, one more. of them is full art. <laughs> it doesn't count. Uh, one, two, three, four. First, I'm putting out a transmogrant altar. Pay a black. Sacrifice a creature. Add three colorless mana to your mana pool. Pay two. Sacrifice a creature. Create a three-three colorless zombie artifact creature token. Activate this only as a sorcery. Hmm. And then with that last floating black, I will play a Carrion Feeder. Jeez. Carrion Feeder can't block. Sacrifice a creature, put a 1-1 one, one counter on Carrion Feeder. And, uh, you're scary. So are you sure yeah, there's no more like, space on the plane? You're going to need you to check your fact. Carrion Feeder? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hold right now. Everybody's holding. Oh, Alright, bag of holding. I will untap and draw. Did you care carry it? Right, I'm gonna play planes, so Forest Plains Island Swamp. Oh boy. And it tricks us out. Flying Vigilance Death Touch Lifelink. At the beginning of my end step, I get to proliferate. So, you have nothing in the air. I have nothing. I'll attack you for two. Ugh. And so you're gonna take two and then one toxic. So one poison. Give it to me. Give it to me. I have no follow-up plays, we're on that timer. so on my end step, I'm going to proliferate, yeah, so everybody gets another poison card. Uh, have I mentioned you suck? <laughs> and and go. that's it, because that's my end step. Oh boy. I will play a command tower, and I will tap. One, two, three. Right. I guess I have four. Let's see. Does that change what I want to do? I can still do it, right? I don't know what you're talking about. Carrion feeder. I can sacrifice a creature. That's at any time because there's no yes. cost to it. Yes. yes. I will sacrifice the snake to the carrion feeder. I'll put sure. one one counter on the carrion feeder. Snake is gone. Makes it two two, and then you get to put on the snake. Ah, I see what you're doing here. We're gonna, we're gonna have to shoot something over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should uh, proliferate his one one counters. Not gonna happen. <laughs> Bro, I'd like, I'd like to reclaim my time here. <laughs> please, please put my time back on the play clock. You got it. Let me finish. <laughs> All right. Pay three for a coming attraction. Search my library for a basic land card. Put it on the battlefield tap. Then shuffle. Open an attraction. So let's see what I get here. I got a balloon stand. Visit. Choose one. Create a one one red balloon creature token with flying. Uh, sacrifice a balloon if you do target creature gains flying until the end of turn. So here's a question. Yes. Building an attraction is not the same as visiting the attraction. Yes. There's some other right. things. There. That visit. The rules are all literally on the back there for you, so you know. Because I believe when you roll, when you meet the uh, roll a six-sided die as your main phase begins. Yeah. Visit each attraction with the result lit up. Got it. Yep. So whatever is lit up on the edge there Borrowed is, decks. is yeah. what you have Threes to... Threes and sixes. Yeah. So you never know. So it's a, literally a 50-50, I think. 50, <laughs> 50, 50, well, yeah. 50, 50, Threes and sixes. 50, 50. But for me, it's more like an 80. 80-20. Mm. 
Uh, all right. I need to search for a basic land card, and while I'm doing that, Simon can go. All right. Simon can go and draw for turn. I guess it will be a fivest. <laughs> oh, is it already midnight? We got the giggles? No, I thought that was generally seat of, empi- of the Empire. <laughs> and then I'm going to tap three. Oh, you played the... Yeah, the fancy legendary land that if I wanted to channel it, I could kill something. Gotcha. Which That's did. attacking. I'm going to pay three for Foundry Inspector to make artifacts cost one less to cast for me. Discount. And tap the last mana for some Swift Foot Boots. Oh, that's Swift. Swift Foot Boot. All right. Okay. Go ahead. Hmm. All right, beginning my upkeep, I get to create a Snick. I see. Snick boy. What's going on here? Snake tap. boy. Draw. I'm going to tap a black or a swamp, and I'm going to play Village Rights. Oh. I'm going to sacrifice the snake. <laughs> Oh, great bird. There, I get to draw two cards. One, two. Okay, good. Card draw. Yeah. How you use can get it, right? Whatever I can do. Okay, now. I, okay. Okay, one, two, three, and then I'm gonna play uh, Mahadi, Pure and. Emporium Master. I really like He's that card. Cat Devil. He's a three-three. At the beginning of your up, beginning of your end step, create a treasure token for each creature that died this turn. That's really good. Yeah. You're gonna at least get one. Yeah, because gonna we'll catch it. So no attacks. Hmm. I don't feel like I have the power to crack heads. So I'm going to. Uh, <laughs> going to uh, create a treasure token in my end step, and then I'm going to pass the turn. Okay, untap, untap, and draw. Who has flying and who does not? Who I do flying? not have flying. I, you do? I don't. You said I, nobody does? Nobody has flying. Nobody has flying. You're the only one with the... Oh, interesting. You can do things, especially if she's got vigilance. Ugh. Yeah, she's... Ugh. She's a meanie. Ugh. Alright, I am going to attack you for two, Simon, in the air, and then toxic one, so one effect, and can I'll attack you with my commander for four? Still <laughs> so in the air, and then I gain four. And then, not cool, bro. Second, me, I'll do a couple things. I'm going to attack a planes for crawling chorus. It's a 1 1 toxic one. When it dies, I get a 1 1 colorless Phryxian Might artifact creature token with toxic one that can't block. And it looks weird. It does look <laughs> weird. I'm surprised it's common because that's like a good card. I don't know. It's, just, it's, it's like a Doom Traveler. Super good yeah. for a common card. Yeah, you're right. But, but, it's, it's, but toxic, it's got the addition though. of toxic. And yeah. it's like, come on. It's... One drop with a 1 1, get a toxic guy at the end. And I'm going to pay three. For a Phyrexian Atlas, Ooh. I get to add one man of any color, and it has corrupted, so whenever Phyrexian Atlas becomes tapped, each opponent who has three or more poison counters loses one life. And you could just literally tap it and float mana and pass you your turn. You know it. Man, right. you suck. <laughs> so, I will move to my end step, and I will proliferate. Everybody will get another poison oh, counter. Hey, I'm bro. almost halfway dead already. <laughs> bro. Think about it. You're not going to attack me with it? I don't know. You're getting scary. <laughs> and I guess no deal? Mm. I got nothing else to offer. That was my end step so over to you, Dan. Wow. Untap. And on your upkeep, I will tap Frixian Atlas for uh, floating a color, any color mana. I'll float a white mana. And then everyone who has three or more poison counters loses a life. Ugh. That's disgusting. That is just that whole. That is disgusting. This game's gonna be over before I even start. <laughs> yeah. Before you roll that dice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> One. One. That didn't help. Uh-uh. All right. Did not get to visit the balloon stand. Draw for turn. Wait, did I throw money in turn? the balloon stand? So we did money not draw the balloon stand. <laughs> draw for turn. Just a draw. There's always money in the balloon stand. 
Yeah, you keep saying that, but it never really makes money. So. <laughs> <laughs> Turn it down. Yeah, it could be the next shirt I get. Fancy mountain. Frozen banana stand. I play a mountain. I tap one, two, four. A swoofu boot. Hey. You guys in your matching boots. Equipped creature has hex proof and haste. Equipped for one. Uh, one, two, three. The veget vegetation abomination. It is a two-two death vegetation. touch that I can tap and sacrifice <laughs> for uh, to uh, roll a six-sided die and gain life equal to the result. You tap oh. it to do that? tap sacrifice. Oh, okay. roll a six-sided die. And you gain life equal to the result. Yeah, if you can get enough dice roll in one turn. Because it's not, I have to roll three dice at the same time. It's over the turn if you roll three dice. Oh. You can activate your commander. I underwear stand. <laughs> Funny, it's one of the very money in the <laughs> Got them silky trousers. <laughs> and that's all I'm doing. All right, that's great. Um, go ahead and untap. To roll for turn. <laughs> Not for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ooh, maybe it is a good day. <laughs> it's close. It's more than 24. <laughs> Tap three for a sword of forge and frontier. Ooh. Oh. Yes. And that's the, that's the one new one that does the... Yeah, that's oh, the... You don't you tap? You should read it. Yeah, so it Artifact gets... spells cost one last, so shouldn't you cast? Oh. Yeah, pay two. Yeah, so I got one floating. Okay. Well, I'll just take this on tap then. <laughs> Alright, so this thing has that uh, quick creature gets plus two, plus two, and has protection from red and from green. And whenever it deals combat damage to the player, exile the top two cards of my library. I may play those cards this turn. I may play an additional land this turn. Ooh, it's not good for me. No. Uh, That's a strong Do sword. I want to take the risk to see if I draw some lands? <sighs> Just pass. Sounds good to me. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. So with that, mm, curses. Oh, that, <laughs> that hey. one floating, and I'm gonna tap Andro. Oh. Put this on the Armory Veteran, which is a four-four with menace. I'm actually gonna swing it at Vince. Yep. And since it's got protection from red and green, I could. You could block, block with the white but creature if you want. I, will I have a question. Four, but... Uh, it says equip two, but I thought you only paid one. Before. No, it was I paid three mana, but I only needed to pay two for it, so I have one floating, and I used the other. I thought you untapped the one in order to unfloat it. No, it was because it's okay. You paid yeah, three for that. Two, paid three for that. I only needed to pay two. Yeah. Okay. Then there was the it looked weird, but it actually. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. It works out. Yeah, yeah. I took the four. All right, so I exile the top two cards of my library, and I can play those cards this turn. I can play an additional land this turn. One. Oh, beautiful. What is that monstrosity? <laughs> Secret layer. That is Warps. the golf sucks now and will, and has always sucked, which is just Battlefield Forge. Oh. So I can add a colorless or add red or white, tonight. and it deals one damage to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Which I'm going to then tap a mountain... Equip Swipe Oh, wait a minute. No, it would have been a different card that... Hmm? That, that I would have drawn that land because whenever I attack with one or more equipped creatures, I draw a card. Okay. So Good. this is the other card that would have been Exile. Okay. Oh. Because it would have been, since I since it was two lands on top, I would have drawn one of the lands. Yeah. Then I would have been able to play that land and, I guess, an Enlightened Tutor. I see. Which, of course... I'm going to cast. So search my library for a artifact or enchantment card, reveal it, shuffle my oh, library, and put that card on tap. I'm going to reveal Hex Gold Hoverweights. That's a four drop artifact that has four mirrored in, so I get a 2 2 rebel when it enters and it gets attached to that. An equipped creature has flying, and equipped creatures uh, you control that are equipped, well, creatures you control that are equipped get plus one plus out. Oh, I think I've read that one. I, was, oh, I, I, stumbled, I stumbled two over creatures. Flying, <laughs> yeah, so flying, and then all my equipped creatures are going to get an additional plus one. Plus I think when we get it, you put something that has flying, that's going to be coming out. What? I'm just kidding. 
No, I only have like reasoning for going to get that specific card. <laughs> I only have like one of those in the deck, I think. One well, I hope so, because you're only allowed one. <laughs> <laughs> I either have one or one, I don't know. All right, and <coughs> that's all I'm going to do for turn. Okay. I mean, everyone already knows what it is, so I might as well leave it like that. I do? Yeah. What's that? Okay. I get that. That's I get the My turn? Oh, okay. Yep. Okay, untap. I will create my snake. I was surprised I was actually able to cast everything. I was expecting to hit, like, Draw a creature in a land and then hopefully just get a land. Turn. So I will sacrifice this treasure for a forest. I will tap two more and I will beast within a track set. Wow. Okay. All right. Have that he didn't want to wait until his turn to make it so that he wouldn't have had a. Doesn't want to wait. He would have had to. He would spend mana and maybe not to be over. get his <laughs> commander back. I might not have the mana. Do not. Okay, Terry missed a lot. Terry missed a lot. Awesome. Creek. Depends on what he draws. <laughs> 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 what he draws. <laughs> Love that show. Um, are they watching that new one, Orange County? <laughs> okay. So I'm at the attack phase, trying to figure out what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to sacrifice this snake, this cold-hearted snake. It's only one ass. I got stuck. And I'm going to put a plus one, plus one counter on my carry-on feeder. <laughs> <laughs> I'll never not hear that now that I did that. <laughs> Here with my dog and here in the carry on theater. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna skip combat and go and uh, to my end step and get a treasure token for uh, for his trigger and then I'm just gonna hold tight and pass. Untap, untap, almost untap, untap, slay, draw. Okay, green and one other, and I'll play track down. I'm gonna scry three. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. And then um, reveal the top card of my library. If it's a land card or creature card or land card, draw it. So tainted observer. He's got the marker. Right so I'm gonna draw it. Wrong draw. <laughs> draw. I we had more than one. Oh. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm drawing it. Um, and then I'm gonna pay. I'm gonna pay one, two, and the friction atlas. I'll tap for green. Mm -hmm. I'll play glistening sphere. Uh, enters the battlefield tapped, but when it enters the battlefield, we're afraid. So each of you guys get death. another poison mm -hmm. counter. Stop that. And then what it'll do is uh, I can add one man of Public any color. Number one. I get to add one mana of any color, and then I can add three mana of any one color. Activate only if an opponent has three or more poison counters. So that's not cool. I don't get tricks now. So I wouldn't be upset. Over here. Just yet. Uh, does anyone have flying yet? I do not. And I feel a crack and back uh, coming. Yeah. Because I have killed the commander. Yeah. But I don't know what's more important. Yeah, I know what's <laughs> Inflicting harm. Well, I was like, <laughs> trying, I was trying to think, but I only have one flying creature, so. All right, right. yeah, I'll take you for two in the air, Ken. Okay. And then um, I get another. And another. Stop poison. And sorry. Sorry about your feet, but. <laughs> um, and, uh, and unfortunately, that's all I'm going to do this turn, so I'll pass to Artist Dan. Actually, if, it, if something has protection from a specific color, can creatures of that color even block it? No. No. Oh. You have protection from so green, I can't block with a green creature. So, you oh. can't. so it's unblockable to you right now. No, you I thought it just couldn't nice. do damage. Because it's got menace. But no, it's pro still yeah, protection from a color means Inner nothing. Head. Sweet. <laughs> I mean, I have white. It's like black and white if you only have protection from one color. Alright, uh, untap. But it's menace. Uh, oh, yeah. I got you. Yeah. That's why I was confirmed. As your main that. phase begins. So draw, roll, six. six. Uh, does the color matter? 
just the color. No, the color don't worry about the color. It's, if right. it's lit up. Create a 1-1 one, one red balloon creature token with it's flying. It's balloon! It's got a beard? <laughs> no, it's a mouth. He's oh. smiling. It's a lot of smiles teeth. Smile. Death. It's a lot of teeth. Those aren't meant to be teeth. It's supposed to be like a wide open, like ah. Oh, okay. kind of smile. Like, the sign that says what protection from a color is. Uh, it means that target creature can't be blocked by creatures of that color, can't be targeted by spells of that color, or abilities from the sources of that color. Sweet. Can't be enchanted or equipped by auras of equipment of that color, and all damage to the source would be reduced to zero. So if he blocks from the green, he just lives through it. The How does it work with the infect, though? What do you mean? The region block with like a listener. Four. Well, if you have potential green, Oop, I, I can't think... block at all. I think what would happen is since it can't be dealt damage by that oh, color, it, there won't, is. it since in fact does damage in the form of neg one neg one counters, it doesn't deal it, since it's not off. dealing Face damage. It's, not gonna be creepy. Gotcha. it's a balloon creature token. Alright, just scary. Balloons are hollow. So if it's a creature, it probably has a face, right? <laughs> Maybe? I thought the there. eyes would freak you out more than the mouth, honestly. I no, the mouth is large, so it is creepy. I think it's funny. He doesn't even have teeth. It looks like a bunch of teeth. I guess. <laughs> I mean, it's not as creepy as this picture, but it's up there. <laughs> it's <a trip> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna pay one, two, three for priority boarding. Whenever I roll a die, I may reveal the top card of my library. Do this only once each turn. Whenever you reveal a card with a mana value less than the result this way, you may exile it. If you do, you may play it this turn. Alrighty. Oh, let's go. Alright. On tap. Got a balloon. Roll for turn. What'd you get? A balloon. <laughs> Red, uh, the tab, uh, a white, <laughs> a red, and one colorless. Uh, I don't have red and markers. thanks to Foundry Inspector, I'm going to cast <laughs> Hex Gold Hover Wings. Hey. Yeah. Which has four Mirrodin, so I'm going to make a 2-2 two -two red rebel creature token and attach it to it. Equipped creature has flying, and equipped creatures I control uh, will get uh, plus one, plus O. Oh. So they can't close their mouth because they have no lips. Oh my god. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead <laughs> and make it horrifying and I love it. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and move straight to before you end up like He's going crazy. to combat. Yep, I'm gonna know. swing the uh the armory veteran at of course Vince. How many? It is a five four right now, oh. so five, and I'm gonna get to draw a card during the attack. Then uh, since it deals combat damage to you, I exile the top two cards, and I can play them this turn. I can play an additional land this turn. Ooh, ooh, what do you get? What do you get? Loxodon Warhammer and Arden Intrepid Archaeologist. <laughs> Loxodon Warhammer. Man, they just push that card like. But it's, it's, it's crazy is how good it is. Yeah, Even though it's been around forever, and I always the, cut it. Ooh. I know, but that's the thing. So do I. But look at how good it is. <laughs> I would love to be able to. They even stuck it in that uh, Warhammer. So. Because yeah, Arden will get me my equipment kind of in the name. equipped way <laughs> cheap, like way less expensive. Because <laughs> I can only pick one tech, because I only got three mana. Whoa, schnarts. Can you give me another yeah. card? Well, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and you need a dice? I'm going to cast, <laughs> cast Arden. So. Oh. Okay. The other one gets exiled? or? Yeah, also infiltration ones because it costs one less. Oh, you. Oh, yeah. wow. So this is just going to be perma exile. Where'd you get the extra one? Uh, extra. It's cost one and artifacts cost oh, one less. Oh yeah, that so. was zero drop right there. So yeah. locks it on Warhammer is just going to be perma exile. The exile next to the bacon. Indeed. And that's my turn. All right. Upkeep snake. Untap. Draw. Sweet. Sweet. Mm. Command tower. All right. So finally, all four colors. Four. I only needed three. I need three. I'm sorry. Three. You're right. Okay. I finally got. Yeah, I got you. You know that. Right. Four. Two. That's actually perfect. Mm -hmm. All right. I'll pay four and. Here oh, comes right. my it does cost commander. Uh, Zira, the golden sting. Insect assassin. And she has haste. Alright. Uh, mm -hmm. So, 
before I go to combat, I will sacrifice this treasure for a forest, and I will tap this smoldering marsh, and I'll play three wishes. Oh. Search your library for a forest card, put it onto yeah. the battlefield, and shuffle your library. So I will do that real quick. So I'm going to play uh, Stomping Ground. Enters the battlefield. Uh, you may pay two life. If you don't, Stomping Ground enters the battlefield tap. So that's fine. Alright, so Stomping Ground comes into play tapped. <laughs> could you cut? Please. Indeed, I can. Yeah, yellow. So is the back like. <laughs> Oh! Alright. Artifact. Oh. Is that an artifact? Um, artifact. I will sacrifice this to carry on feeder to have it go to a 4 4 now. You're gonna have to check that. Well, I'm actually going to use dice <laughs> to keep track of the exact yeah, power level. You hit me pretty hard. You got a flyer. What do we do with this? Um, Alright, so I'm going to attack you with Zyria in the air gotcha. for three. Um, I, I'm curious how this stacks at all. So we'll take three. I get to put an egg counter on another target creature without an egg counter on it. When that creature dies, it, it has an egg counter on it. Draw a card. And create an 1 1 insect with a three dollar unit. Where do I want to put an egg counter? You've got a lot of choices there. I do, but none of them I want to sack. Um, yeah, you should have put it on your snake. Yeah, but. I wanted to get this up to four, so it at least had some power to break through Simon. That's a 3-2? Yep. Okay, well, I'm going to attack with my 4-4 four, four carrion feeder. I'm going to put the egg on the carrion feeder, but I can still attack with Simon. But... I'll go ahead and take four. Take on a lot. Yeah, I wanted to, to you got all that stuff, and you don't want one. All right. Well, i got plenty of life right now. I got you. Hey, we match. Uh, Plus, I'd rather have the uh, protection against a toxic creature <clears throat> in the air. <laughs> um, good point. Yeah. Going to my end step, I will pass the turn. Put these counters on here. You can go. Don't, just, don't mind me. Untap, 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 untap. Draw. Ooh, not a land. Oh, that's right. I remember. I scried last turn, so I knew this was going to be there. <laughs> it's like I've seen it for the what first time. Surprise. Yeah. Alright, so... Glistening Spear taps for a man of any color, but it has corrupted, oh, so um, I get to... I'm sorry. Treasure token. Take back. Yeah, sorry, go right. continue. It has corrupted, so I get to add three man of any one color. I activate only if opponent has three or more poison. So I got to tap this for three of them. Oh color. my. Yeah. One color, though. Okay. Yeah, so I'll just go white, black, green, blue, and I'll just say three green, but I'm only using two of it. Oh, so he's gonna have one treasure. green floating. Two man. Yeah, I have a green floating. <laughs> Universal. Ooh. Probably check with a doctor about that one. <laughs> I have a green floater. I'm probably <laughs> not gonna use it anyways. I don't have two drops in Fortunately, I don't. Um, I feel a crackback coming. Yeah, kind of, but let's see, what is, yeah, you got four, you got five, you got five, so it probably will be, believe it or not, I'm not home right now. Uh, Walking in a spider web. Dan, I'm going to attack you in the, you don't have flying, correct? I do have flying. Oh, he does have flying. Oh, well, 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 a toxic proliferate. Thanks, Brittany. Spears. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to tap this for green. Uh, I am going to leave that there, and everyone's going to take a lose a life for having three or more prison life. That's it. We don't. Oh. Proliferate no, that's right all yet. this one does is whenever friction atlas becomes tapped, each opponent who has three or more poison counters loses a life. Gotcha. Oh. So I just did that to float it just to. Do you, do you have two floating green? Uh, no, that one ended oh, okay. before I, I attacked. Attack. This happened after, and it doesn't matter because I'm not going to use it. Um, I accepted no. 
but I will <laughs> move to my end step and proliferate so everybody will Ooh, get another poison. I'm at power. seven. That's not cool. I'm, sh I'm basically just trying to focus him down. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I went to seven years. Oh yeah, I'm I, at just, six. I just got attacked. Um, so, and I, I don't have much defense other than oh. murder. <laughs> you have murder? Mm. That's my objective. Well, no. I was gonna say that's <laughs> no. a black card. You're not playing black. <laughs> I don't like not it. that spell. Oh, go ahead, Dan. That was my end step. So, alrighty, on tap. Draw a card. Read a card. Roll a die. One. That fizzles. However, Space Family Goblinson gets a counter. That gets for rolling no matter what, right? Doesn't yeah. matter what's actual. Okay. Anytime I roll a die. And since I didn't draw a mana, I think I'm gonna play a card. One, two, four. One, two, three, four. Gotcha. Thunder Wave. Roll a D20. Oh, uh, Ten. Uh, I may choose a creature. Thunder Wave deals three damage to each creature not chosen this way. Oh. Mm. Whoa. Board wipe, I guess. Yeah. Dang, that's uh, me. Alright, I'm gonna choosing die. Space Family Goblinson. So I've rolled a die. Uh, in response to this uh, thing, I'm going to tap and sacrifice uh, Vegetation Abomination. Roll a six-sided die. Well... I want, I want to do this trigger first. So I've rolled a die, I may reveal the top card of my library. Yeah. Oh, oh nice. well, okay. Uh, I may play, <clears throat> whenever I reveal a card with mana value less than the result, so 10, I was really hoping for something big. Uh, pretty good. I may exile it, if I do, I may play it this turn. So, I assume I still have to pay to play it, yeah. so yeah. bam, soul ring. Wow. Um, say. So three damage to every creature? Yeah, but in response, I'm going to tap and sacrifice Vegetation Abomination. Roll a d6. Wow. I would four. I gain four life. I lose everything two, but my three, three, four. I lose everything but Armory Veteran. Uh, so, Dan, you suck. Space Jesus. Family Goblinson <laughs> goes up. I'm upset, too. I lost my Balloon. I lose my Glistener Elf, Void Wing Hybrid, and my Crawling but Chorus. But problem. from Crawling Chorus dying, I do get a Might. Frixian number one might toxic one that can't block. My commander. So that still happened, so I got something, but I can't block. But my commander was a 4 4, so that lived. Yeah. Wait, did that do. You said three. Yeah, okay, three damage. Is that uh, what I said? Yeah, Ten. yeah. Was, if he hit a natural 20, he would have killed creature. everything nah. that we had. Yeah. Well, six damage to each creature my opponent's control. Ooh, yeah. Man. That is a stretch, Ooh, but uh, yeah. you yeah, never know. That was a pretty. That was a, that was good. I had plans, Dan. <laughs> and now they are upset. Yep. I wanted that intrepid guy. See. It would have been so helpful. What did you say about a trumpet? Intrepid. Oh, they said, hey, yeah. trumpet guy. He would have given all, <laughs> like, all the equipment that would have gone on the creature, basically. So you got lucky, then. No. I would have drawn a card. Oh, right, but it didn't die because of you doing that. Yeah. But I lost my... should have put the counter on the snake. I had some engine happening. Yeah. No, you did. I saw that, it kept like, snake this. Snake You're this, scary. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna pay no, me two to equip Goblin Morning Star to Space Family Goblinson. Then... I'm gonna pay one to equip it. So I've got one floater. Equip it! So it's now Hexproof Haste, which is irrelevant. Uh, plus one, plus zero with Trample. I'm wide open if you need to. Uh, I have my commander. This can't block. He's got death touch on his commanders. I do have death touch on my commander. Technically, me and Simon are just wide open. It's With open. arms wide open. <laughs> uh, let's see. Just don't look at their teeth. Oh, wow. You can't Who won it. the last two? Was it Chris? The last two what? Games? Simon. Simon? <laughs> oh. Chris won the first one. Simon won the second one. Ken. I'm here. <laughs> Five. You were in the first one, you weren't in the second Commander. Okay. But it's Ooh. all right, you're going to die to infect. Yeah, probably. Jeez. We're all going to die to infect. You don't know, know that. that. I know things. So I'm like, so stuff. focused on Vince because I'm. He's already done. edited the game. He knows who wins. Oh. <laughs> Man, that's pretty good. <laughs> Skills. 
That's how it works, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're in now. <laughs> right now. <laughs> now, now? Yes, sir, now. Well, what happened then? You edited it in the you past, just it. and then you play the game, right? When? Now! That's how it works. <laughs> All right, I'm done with my turn. Oh. I'm going to go back and take a nap. That was a pretty good turn. Tap. Yeah, it was. Yeah, a little board wipage. Draw for some turn. commander damage. The commander's pretty strong. That was good. Like, Didn't wipe axe guard everything. armory. Somehow you got a Frexian might. This was a four four. When this died, I get one. Yeah. It means I'm open, so you can smack me with him. So this your flyer. <laughs> I'm gonna tap two for a relic seeker. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's got Reno 1. Reno. Reno. Reno 9 Well, yeah. Nobody on this channel going to know if we're purposely mis <laughs> mispronouncing things or no, not. No, that, that first one just Everyone says Reno. I get to know you a little better. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I, don't. <laughs> what is, what is I think I've said the library correctly like four times. Yeah, and whenever and it deals combat damage to player, if it isn't Reno, it gets a 1 1 counter and becomes Reno. Okay. And when it becomes Reno, I get to search my library for a critical card, reveal it, and put it into my hand and shuffle. Okay, that's what it does. Yep. Wait, what's it do? <laughs> it's we'll get to fetch a equipment in a moment. In a moment? In a moment. It says I'm going to tap this for a colorless. Put swift foot boots on Relic Seeker. Oh, in a boot. moment. Now I understand. Ping. Um, Pong. Ah, it's a machine that goes ping. ping. It's the most expensive machine in the hospital. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and... Surely. <laughs> you got your joys of me. It has stand. menace, I can't. Yeah, I know, that's what I was this can't No, it's the other one that has menace. So I'm swinging Relic Seeker at you. Aww. It's a 2 2. Okay. And then this is a 5 4 protection from red green swinging at you, Vince. Red green? Oh, man. I can't yeah, and it's got menace. Well. At least well. find your handy. All right. I take 5. <laughs> yep. Well, yeah. And that's just an artifact. Oh, wait, no, this is a 3 2 because it's equipped, so. So you took three. Hondo, I took five. Five. Yeah, so it's, it's a three, two that hit you. Not a two, two. He hit you for three. He hit me for three? Yeah. He said he you, me but two. you meant you. Yeah, my bad. I forgot about hex gold hover wings, because creatures you control that are equipped get plus one, plus oh. That changes so everything. did I take five or six? It was just five. Okay. Yeah. And then since it dealt combat we'll damage to you, two. exile top two <laughs> cards. I can play an additional land this turn. Oh, yeah? Mountain. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, banter? That's scary looking. Okay. So no banter. That is creepy. Not as creepy as the other one, but it's creepy. It's basically the other one in the dark. Then... <laughs> it's good picture though. Yeah. I guess I'm going to tap three. Cast the mana list. The size of his He's been able to get value out of everything that he's been exiting. Like he's almost gotten everything. I've been trying to not spend too much mana before I actually do that. <laughs> no, I, that's it's good. good. You've been really um, getting a lot of money. Here. Go ahead. All right. Hmm. Tap. All right. Let's see <laughs> what I can do. I know what I can do right here. I want to do something else. But is there any kind of deal I can strike with you, Vince? Me? For mercy. What do you. Wow. Like, I don't know. I just don't want to. Die to poison. Well, I'm going to get proliferate. Yeah, proliferate. I mean, I get to choose, but I mean, that's kind of the whole point. So. I haven't been able to. I think he's more scared of me right now because of scared? my hate bonus. <laughs> he is correct. <laughs> Wait, what did you just say? The hate boner. <laughs> I've never heard the word, the term hate boner before. I... <laughs> it's a random phrase. Sounds like it's more than one. Look one. here, Rafi. I don't know what you're talking right now. <laughs> <laughs> Fear. P2. I'm gonna Fear play boner. Murder hate boner. boner. <laughs> Murder <laughs> boner. I'm going to play Goblin. Second harvest. <laughs> I'm going to play Goblin. What's that? Again? Ancromancer. Yeah, he had that out. Uh, Goblin Shaman. Each spell you cast that's red or green costs one less to cast, and it's 2-2. Two, two. Yay! I'm going to do it this way, Vince. Oh, boy. I have a card uh -huh. that can handle... But you're going to proliferate. God! 
It doesn't matter. I can't win this. Like, hey, could you please not do something? But it's still gonna do something to me no matter what. Yeah, you don't want me to attack, but like, I don't want the proliferate gonna because it's gonna kill me in a way. So it's like, I I, I have to do it. So I understand. To. Chaos War. Yeah. I mean, we could get something much worse. If you got that dinosaur in there. Well, oh, the thing is, God. this is going in the command zone, so. Now it costs four. I just so shuffle a eight now. empty. Yeah, it does. Here. But yeah, you it's have it. It still sets me back a turn because yeah, it does. But I might have wanted to do other yeah. stuff. So it's gonna be blade hold. Warwick. All right, so That's what it's, was going in my hand? Blade hold Warwick. Yeah, it makes it so that you know it makes a rebel, of course, and it makes it so that equipment equipment activations cost one less to activate for like other equipment. But it goes to your hand. Yeah, it's in my hand. Okay. And equipped creature's gonna have double strike. Oh my lord. So I'm gonna make it. Right, that thing, this comes out to the battlefield. That thing, I think, yeah. So. Right. I mean, you still could cast your commander. I mean, I'm like, gonna, but like I said, that sucks because I had all the plans. I was trying to get through a turn and no, not I get die because I got stuff I want to cast, but I'm, I'm at seven poison and I know I'm gonna die to poison unless mm -hmm. I do something, so. Ignore so I'm going to sack this token, and I'm going to tap this, I'm going to tap this, I'm going to sacrifice a creature and create a 3-3 colorless zombie artifact creature token, activate this as a sorcery, because we're in my second main, so the carrion feeder will die, oh, okay. I'll get to draw a card because of that egg counter, I create a 1-1 uh, green insect Creature token with flying. Yeah. Three, 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 Don't three. have an insect creature with flying because I didn't make one. Or what gives you the one one insect? That egg when it fell off. Oh, okay. So you get that and the three three. Yeah, because I used this yeah. ability. So there's my three three zombie artifact. Uh, you know what? I know it's an artifact insect, but that's going to represent my flying insect. Doesn't have haste. Ignore the haste. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Marker. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, <laughs> yeah, that's for me. I'm gonna pass. Yes, um, all right, we untap all this. Stuff. Pass the value. Take a piece of paper and just cover up the draw. <laughs> oh goody. A land. So maybe this will help me a little bit. So now I gotta pay eight for my commander. You say? Yeah. Eight, you say? So I counted. As, as he was doing his turn, I'm sitting there going, You have it. I was glad that I yeah. pulled that Sword of Forge and Frontier. Super White. helpful. Well, technically, you have 10 mana sitting right there. Black, green, blue, and then I gotta pay another four, so I'll tap this for three green, just for the heck of it. Please, three and green. One. There you go. So that's what, four? One, two, four. three, four. Four, eight, ten. Yeah, you got it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I do got to be all of it. Oh, will be I was hoping one, to have one more. Seven, eight. Eight. Yeah, it's eight. I, I thought it was ten. It's eight. Ah, that is rough because I can't do anything. She's anymore. still going to proliferate. Uh, so I really didn't do I mean, anything. Yeah, I feel like I kind of have no choice on this, but I... I could have saved it for right before it went off. And I'm going to tap this for blue, float it, probably won't use it, but everyone's going to take a damage from that. Lose a life for it. Mm. Um, man, I absolutely We're tied. Wait, <laughs> do I? Can I? The mic can't block, so I will attack Dan for one. Dun, 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 take one and take one there. Uh, then I will move to my end step, and I will proliferate the poison counters on everybody. Stop it! <laughs> then, um, whenever I proliferate, I can return Voidwing Hybrid from the graveyard to my hand. Oh, no. Oh, my. I can't recast it right now. Did you see that other one? Oh, yeah, you, you moved your end steps. Yeah. Well, uh, yeah. There's a green-black so one that yeah. has it on there where you can pay and return a creature. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I either missed it or I didn't. I'll have to show it to you. Or I just don't remember it. What do I get? A card. Yeah, yeah, if you get that one Dominus in there, it's gonna be super mean. Gonna, if you get the Dominus in there, it's gonna like double speed the hot attracts. So that's gonna be crazy. Which one? The, the black, blue the, one. The counter one. 
the blue mm -hmm. one. Well, you know, um, three. The uh, green friction Prater um, Hornclex also would double the oh double the. He's got that you? totally not creepy, creepy looking balloon back out. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Just a balloon, guys. What did you write on there? Ooh, he's trying. <laughs> That's good. Uh, oops. <laughs> wow. <laughs> a draconian gate bot. When he enters the battlefield, open an attraction. All the attractions. First wheel. For crack. Visit. Choose a target creature that hasn't been phased out with Ferris wheel. That creature phases out until you roll a three or less while rolling to visit your attractions. It's kind of like the whirly dirty. <laughs> 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 Yeah. When did you get cool? <laughs> wow, Jerry, when did you get cool? <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Surprisingly, I don't have enough mana to do anything. Really? Nothing Okay, so I rolled one, so that goes up one. No, oh, boy. Back. Six. Oh boy. That's Simon? No. Let's see. <laughs> uh, I was assuming. <laughs> he said, at Simon? Oh, no, that's right, because you can't block. Vince is winning. Oh, Simon so can't block, though. Simon you can block. I know, but I'm not gonna. I know. How many? Six. Bing bong, bing bong, bing bong. Commander. Uh, I know you know. Oh, no, I, I, I know you know, I know you know. I just know. wanted to rub it in. You know, I know you know you know. I know, I know you know. <laughs> Yeah, me too. <laughs> you know? No, no, not really. Uh, that is me done. <laughs> All right. E crop. On tap. Oh boy. I wouldn't be raw for sure. <laughs> All right, so oh, I'm going dumb. to start. Oh, you're real. Yeah, I should have checked. Three. Tapping five mana. Mm -hmm. Commander Liara Porter. Whenever oh. I attack, spells I cast from exile this turn cost X less to cast, where X is the number of players being attacked, and exile the top X cards of my library until at end of turn you may cast spells from among those exiled cards. Too many words. I'm, yeah. I'm In other words, when I attack, I exile equal to the number of players being attacked, so and all cards. my spells will cost X less uh, as, like, for that turn less. from three exile. Less. Yeah. Yep. So maximum. I'm actually trying to build a deck around. Really? Yeah, I know. I, it's really cool. Like, it was a really cool Should thought to think about. I don't know that was even from. Boulder's Gate. Right. No, I mean, like, which deck? Three. I don't think it wasn't was in a deck. Oh, it was in a set. Yeah, yeah tap three oh, mana okay. for Bladehold Warwind. Oh, I did not know you had that card. <laughs> yeah, so for Mirrodin, I get a 2-2 two -two Rebel. Mirrodin. And equip abilities you activate of other equipment cost one less to activate, and equipped creature has double strike. Yeah. Oh, boy. So then, pass. because of the effect of Bladehold Warwind, I'm just going to do that. And pass. Put that on him. Are you equipping for free, basically? Yeah, yeah. He's for anything that's a one equip. Oh, wow. That thing is... Reduces equip cost by one. Like, I heard it, but it was just one of those where it was like... Then... Wow. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and... Move to combat. I will... Remember you. <laughs> I'm going to send a... 2-2 two, two, double strike at Dan, a 2-2 two, two with whenever equipped creature becomes blocked by a creature, he may draw two cards at Uncle Kenny. And How much? Well, I know it's a 3-3, three, three, my bad. It's a 3-3. Three, three. Okay. Wait, 4-3. <laughs> my brain. Is it flying? Let me let me put these counters on here so I know what the things are. So this is tech so this is actually 3 2. So whatever these little I say. So 3 2. Oh, I don't hear a thing. 3 3. Oh, I'm just going to look back. That's a counter. So yeah, 3 3 non flying at you. Okay, I'll block 3 2 my double strike at you. Oh, and a 5 4 menace protection from red green at Vince. So 5. 
Yeah, five. five. I can't. I block with a four-two. Your thing dies. It's no. This is double strike. Yeah. So it oh, hits wait, it has during first, first strike, strike phase. Yeah. So. Oh, buckets. Pop your balloon. <laughs> no, I need the flyer. I'll block with my. I'll block uh, anyway. Three-three zombie RT. Yeah, and also, he's he's scary. Three uh, exiled. Uh oh. And that's from her. Oh. Yeah. You got no, no hairy, no, no, no hairy, and you got yeah, wrecking crew. And then I get to, I'm gonna get to do the other two as well. Okay. Did you block this? Yeah. All right. So it's mostly. I okay. blocked with the three three, so they they okay. trade and die. Yeah. So then I draw two because of when it becomes blocked, yeah. it'll be the next thing to go off. Cool. Then. Sword of Forge and Frontier, exile another two. I don't think you can cast any of those. Well, might as well just throw them out. And they're gonna... <laughs> <laughs> He's right. So they're gonna cost three less to cast from exile, mm -hmm. and... So pass. And I can play two lands, since I haven't played any land this turn. I don't think you have any. <laughs> so, cast a soul ring, play two planes. Just normal ones? Plain planes? It's going to cost three colorless less to cast. Yep, so I cannot cast Reckless Crew right now. Uh, 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 uh. I don't think it matters. You're soul ring for an arcane right signet. There it is. Tap it for a red for Reckless Crew. Does this happen at your end? Or your second main? Second main. Okay. So yeah, this is second main. Double chicken. Right here. So Reckless Crew makes X21 red dwarf berserker creature tokens where dwarf. X is the number of <laughs> vehicles I control plus the number of equipment I control, which I control one, two, three, four, five equipment. So I get five I'll two. Your vehicle. <laughs> <laughs> you made me actually think about that for a moment. I was like, what? <laughs> Sucker. Yeah. But you do have a vehicle outside, yes? That's true. So, <laughs> but is he controlling it right now? So I'm probably not. Did you sit on your keys and start on it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so. So it only happened that one time. Yeah, probably, yes. It sucked. Getting five, two, one berserkers. So, War. Yeah, that's he's really keen to use his off brand. He's a quick. You, you, it's, it's quick. Uh, the berserkers look like a five sided dice. And they walk around going. Then. My. Dorf. I can't Dorf. I don't have any red mana left, which is unfortunate. Yeah, it is. So. It is. <laughs> We have been at this. Tap three. Stop doing <laughs> things. Mall of Skyclaves. Oh, yeah. Um, we are a porter. Mall of Skyclaves. Yep. When it enters the battlefield, attach the target creature you control. Equip creature gets plus two, plus two, has flying and first strike. Good thing you're So it's a attacking. seven five. Yeah. You said seven five. Yeah. Yep. But he's done attacking. I might just get a turn. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. He's out of mana, he's out of attacks. But wait, there's so, more. I'm pretty that sure. That is. Unless he's got any one casting cost. Yeah, that's the end of my turn of since I couldn't cast this uh, nice horn of Harry that I know you wanted real bad. I really wanted to cast it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, instead, I, you had to cast nine other things. I mean, you I know, know, yeah. Could have paid two life, made it cheaper. All right. We didn't have so it. So these are the equipment that are not attached right now. Hmm. Go ahead. It happened! It happened. I, I got my turn. Untab. Very, very good turn, yeah. Simon. Untab. Oh, thank thank you. You. Oh. Uh, I'm typically afraid of exiling cards from the top of my library. Because you might been, not be able to play them. Yeah. yeah, but I'm like... But that's what Red does. I mean, half the cards in your deck you don't play anyways throughout a Commander game, so... And I need them. Yeah. <laughs> I know. It's... Yeah. It's Red just does that a lot. I mean, it's there way to draw, so just do it. Mm -hmm. I think oh. we'll Alright. Oh. Um, Alright. <laughs> just so I have some power on board. <laughs> Why does that look 
<laughs> okay, good. I'm I am drawing. Start it out. Zatora right the Incinerator. Holy crap! Dora the six six uh, demon dragon with flying at the beginning. Huh. Of, at the beginning. I of, wonder where all that damage is going to be set. At the beginning of your end step, you may search and you may sacrifice another creature. When you do, Zatora the Incinerator deals damage equal to that creature's power to any target. You may create three treasure tokens. That oh, that costs one less to cast. That is super mean. Man, that could be a commander. <laughs> I just got it in the deck. Yeah, I actually... What is that? Uh, three-headed uh, donkey? It's Chris. I will pay... <laughs> one there we go. Red. Oh, I see it now. Their hands. And I will also That's play... His hat. And he's got the beard. <laughs> he has his arms up. It's Chris. He <laughs> always has his arms up. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> And I'll play an impulsive pilfer. Oh jeez. Uh, when it dies, create a treasure token. I do. Alright, moving through since nothing has haste, I will bounce. I will play a land for turn, Rectos Cranium. Karen and Air near. Now bounce this mountain to my hand and I will pass my turn and fear death. Is coming for me. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see what's left. Oh, I mean, I'll tap everything. Actually, that's a second. It's and draw. Because of the, okay, that it's actually an eight hell. because of. What are you doing? I keep forgetting it's my turn. Stop it. <laughs> I'm, I'm just this forest. putting counters. Don't you worry. All right, I won't you worry. Don't worry me about a thing. I'm gonna pay green it's and blue. One other for Tainted Observer. It's a 2-3 oh. Flying Toxic 1. Whenever another creature enters the battlefield under my control, I may pay 2 if I do periphery. Oh no. Yippee. So, two. Let's see. How do I want to proliferate? If you can proliferate three times, I'm just dead. I'm gonna pay. Actually, no, everyone's dead. One. I'm gonna so play black. Two creatures. And then and I'm gonna for the extra. tap this for blue, and I'm gonna play void wing All right. hybrid. I am going to pay two to proliferate. Pro All right. Pro two with my team just observer. Once. Once. Everyone gets another. Oh, counter. I'm dead. Now let's and see if he casts four. another creature. If he does, everyone's dead. No, no yeah. If he can pay for it, that is. Ken's dead. I'm going to oh, pay if he can cast one more. We're three dead. black. Oh, everyone lost a life because I tapped the... I don't think it matters. I'm going to pay three black for Infectious Query. Draw two cards, lose two life. Each opponent gets a poison Oh, counter. that's game. <laughs> it's game for All me. All he's got to do yeah. is end his turn. Oh. oh. Nicely done. No. I will move to my end step and proliferate. Everyone gets a poison <sighs> counter. Oh. Nice. Good game. I had some good <laughs> stuff. I had in my too. hand. <laughs> that was my next card. <laughs> That was when you made me cast my commander two more times, oh I was waiting to use this for three greens so I could cast it. And I was like, I'm never going to get to play it because I keep making me cast my commander. <laughs> and I called it. Too. I wasn't getting any of my other proliferate stuff, oh. so I had to keep using this for proliferate. powerful card in uh, the game. Yeah. I was like, I'm, I need the proliferate. I'm not getting any other proliferate stuff, so I have to keep casting my commander. I was going to leave it and just do other things, but I wasn't getting it. So wow. Once I, once I saw this, I was like, oh, I can do three points next turn. Wow. The next set of equipment would so I was just so like, nice. don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Yeah, wow. I was real scared during that turn. You're like, pass me. Yeah, like, yeah. I, I would have been able to get <laughs> That yeah, should be a short game for you for the, for the yeah, headache. It's an hour and 15, <laughs> or 20, that I can move down. These but, were the last two equipments in my hand. See, it almost looks like it has three heads, but now I see you just put gloves on it. Yeah, it's wow. Chris holding two... Um, Oven mitts. <laughs> yes. Yeah, wow. No. Uh, congratulations, I've not died to poison. Yes. So... Is it a first for all of us to die to poison? <laughs> <laughs> On the channel? I think so. Just generally, I've never... Yeah, because we, we did the pre-con, then we did the pre-con the second time, and like, I was trying to do... We all kind of got some poison out there, but no one died from it. I'm saying, I believe that's the first time I've ever died to poison. Oh, like Play ever, 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 ever? Yeah. Wow. No, I've, I've definitely been killed by poison by one of you guys before. One me. I mean, honestly, I, I, don't I really could play with. Uh, she's she's it, another it potential. Like one deck one time, and I was like, "What the I know fuck is this?" Because it was the first time I saw that mechanic, and I was just like, "I know he played this quite a few times." I'm like, "This is a load of horse shit." 
Well, it was originally built around like 1-1 one -one counters, and I can't remember what else the original deck did. I know it was 1-1 one -one counters, but there was other stuff, and I was like, it was scary with the 1-1 one -one counters, but like I just wanted to do something different. And like I said, mm. this deck, with this new set coming out, it just kind of like really helped the pump the thing in the overdrive. Pump up the jam. Pump it up.